And if I took a loss, I'm a boss in my hood Whoa. I'm sounding like I'm boss in the hood Double cross me, I leave you on the cross in the hood I'm good, I got new money shoes or any other shoes that I review on my channel, you might want to hit me up on one of them platforms, preferably IG. Alright, and while you at it, hit that like button, hit that bell, drop a comment, and most importantly, subscribe to the channel if you do dig the content. Now, with all that being said, let's get straight into it. This right here is a Union Jordan 4. The Guava Ice. See that? Boom. Size ten and a half. Air Jordan 4 Retro SP. For these, my personal opinion the toe box is like real um narrow so i, I got a half a size up usually jordan fours you got to do a half a size up anyway for most people you know like me jordan ones i like my jordan ones snug so my fours i gotta go a little bit a little bit bigger on the size now look at these you know when they came out i ain't gonna hold you it took a while for them to um for me to gravitate towards them. I didn't like them for a minute, especially this colorway right here. I think, um, it's me personally, even still, I like the black joints the better and the purple, the Desert Moors joints. Yeah, I, I do like the Desert Moors better than these. That's just my opinion. I know a lot of people is gonna pick these over them and I ain't mad at that. But um, yeah, they got, you know, the pink, pinkish suede right here with the, like a reddish pink up top, the age midsole, age cage, and all that. Union, what what stand this? What what the, uh, makes this stand out more than other Jordan fours and any other Jordan fours? They took the tongue and sewed it down, so you only get like half a tongue. So it's not like that big tongue that you normally get. And I guess some people do like that. Some people cut cut the um threads right there and open the, the you know the tongue back up. But I think that's what makes this shoe unique. So me personally, I wouldn't cut it open and open it back up. But, you know, to each his own. Um, you know, dope shoe. Love the concept. Union, you know, did they thing. I think they kind of fell off after these, I think. Not, not for me personally. I'm talking about like resale and to the masses and all that. But I do like the Union 2s. I do like, um, what else they came out with after that? Um, they had the, um, the press, not the press, those, the Cortez. I do like the Cortez. Uh, they had a couple things. They had a couple joints. Um, I think I, I think the Dunks came out after these, if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, I like um, all the other collabs. They, it's always a hit for me. They really be doing their thing. For me, personally, I think what what, what like kept me away from them and what would what, have what made these better is if the uh, midsole was broken up. Like if the midsole wasn't the same color as the outsole, I think that would have been a whole lot better. Just, you know, to break it up, it's just too much of one color. That's much like the Fragment Jordan 3s. A lot of people didn't like it because it's all white midsole and outsole. And I, and I understand that. You know, I don't really like the same color outsole as the midsole. Like, to me, it's, it's just, it's kind of bland in my humble opinion. But some people, less is more. Some people really like that aged look. Um, me personally, I'm tired of the age look on everything. Like, we don't need that look on everything. You want old sneakers, just buy some new ones and let them sit. Or rock them. <laughs> Trust me, they'll get old. They'll get old quick. But, you know, the good old Nike Air on the back, you cannot go wrong with that. You got the, um, Union LA tag. Right there, as usual. What's different about these two is the, the, the wings is not cut out. So, it's a solid piece. That's what's different too. It's very extremely small cage right here in the front. That's what's different about these fours too as well. And you know, not, not um, nothing else really. Just thick cut, thick cut leather or thick cut suede. You got the mesh right here that, you know, for me personally, I could have done without it. I don't really like mesh. Once that gets dirty, it's very hard to clean too as well. So maybe you should get some if you do got these and you plan on rocking them, get some spray repellent to keep the dirt and off of there. That'd be very good. You got the hang tag, the union hang tag, and nothing special on the outsole. I mean, these are old. They've been out for a minute. 
let me know what y'all think about these it's just nice to refresh the um channel you know my channel got deleted at 15,000 so you know I gotta re-upload and make old videos too as well so it is what it is you feel me but let me know what y'all think about these and what's your favorite out the collection was it the, these the um there's a moss the black ones didn't they come out with some green ones let me know in the comment section if they came out with some green ones. I think I can remember some green ones and what's the name of them if they did. Yeah, I think, I think they're light green. I think that's the only one I don't got. What's the name of them shits? Damn. I know these are the guava ice. You got the desert moss. You got the, um, the black ones. What's the black ones called? I forgot. I forgot what the black ones and the green ones, what they called. So let me know in the comment section. Let me know what's your favorite one. And, um, you know, subscribe to the channel if you do like my content, like I said before. But you already know the vibes. I love y'all. Thanks for rocking with your boy. You feel me? The love is real. You know I love y'all back, man. At the end of the day, rock what you like, not because it's hype. Stand out and never blend in. Holla at me till next time, you heard? 100.